Aloha everyone, welcome to my reflection on AI Explorer Journey, Transforming Teaching with AI. I am Brent and I'm excited to share my insights from the AI-focused webinars hosted by the UHOIC in the fall of 2023 and what I did exploring creating graphics with AI. Presentation outline based off of UHOIC recommended speaking points with design and script inspiration by AI, specifically Canva, Magic Studio, and ChatGPT. Let's kick things off with a brief overview. Today, I'll be sharing the key learnings that shaped my AI Explorer journey this academic year, inspired by the enlightening webinars coordinated by the UHOIC. One of the webinars that greatly influenced my perspective was titled Work Smarter, Not Harder, AI-Based Strategies for Teaching Productivity. Additionally, I had the privilege of accessing insights from an instructional designer who demonstrated her process of using AI to create graphic art and generously answering my questions about the AI tools relevant to my teaching. Now let's do a short show and tell of how these learnings translated into my online courses. I've applied these insights to create visually appealing content that enhances the learning experience for my audience. Next, let's briefly take a look at these two examples. We'll look at the original artwork that came back from the AI. And then for the second one, we'll look at the original artwork and the final artwork that I used and I'll tell you a little bit about the process that I followed with the AI and then fixing it up using traditional Photoshop. Here is an example of a project artwork created using Microsoft Bing and Dolly 3 uh, for the title page artwork for my resource. So this image is generated using AI. The search terms included make an image, online learning and engagement, and H5P. Now let's explore another project in which I created a banner image using a combination of AI and traditional Photoshop technique. The journey from the original AI, which is on the lower left, was generated using search terms for the AI. And then a portion of that artwork was cropped using uh, traditional Adobe Photoshop to the final composition on the right which has a few other layers for text, uh, a blue banner background bar for the text, and then a icon for the H5P software overlaid over the background image, which is a sample from the AI. It was exciting and transformative in the way that I approached making this graphic. Participating in the AI Explorer PD opportunity has significantly shifted my teaching perspective. I can now generate innovative ideas for banner images effortlessly. I look forward to the future when AI processes can seamlessly produce editable file formats like SVG and Adobe Illustrator files. How has this journey affected my students? Well, I'm thrilled to share that I'll be rolling out a document titled Practical Guide to H5P in the upcoming Spring 2024 semester. Personally, the visual appeal of my projects adds an extra layer of enjoyment to my work, and I hope that it translates to a more inviting experience for my audience of faculty and staff. Of course, no journey is complete without its challenges. I've encountered some challenges in accessing this emerging technology, particularly through the Microsoft account, Edge browser, Bing chat, and Dolly 3 process. I didn't realize how many hoops I had to jump through just to prompt the software to make a graph. There were several. However, with a bit of perseverance, these challenges were overcome, often through creative solutions using traditional tools like Adobe Photoshop and Adobe Photoshop's AI generative fill. To those interested in embarking on a similar AI exploration journey, my advice is to start small, but have a meaningful goal in mind. Keep detailed notes in a Google Doc and regularly revisit and refine your notes, removing any unhelpful or unused details. This is an iterative process and it will prove invaluable as you navigate the realm of AI. In conclusion, this AI Explorer journey has been transformative for me. And today I've shared the insights gained and showcased the tangible outcomes from my resource document. Thank you for joining me and aloha.